following program is in described video for the visually impaired. It is also suggested that you listen to it under the influence of heavy drugs. Thank you. Okay, so I've had this requested many times, but um, normally I don't end up with Thames at the grain phase, so I haven't really had an opportunity to show anybody yet, but recently uh, we had quite a bit of floods um, down here in Texas, maybe you all heard about the hurricane that almost hit us, it brought a shit ton of rain for like six days it rained, and we had a lot of floods and a lot of people lost power. So, um, because of that, um, there was no temperature control, and as you guys know, down here in South Texas, it gets hot as hell. Well, uh, all my jars tanned. I think, uh, I don't really know what happened, but days without air condition to cool them off, and the room getting probably easily over 100 degrees, uh, they tanned out. So, as you can see, this jar looks pretty bad looks pretty bad. So, what you do initially, I've already done a few of them, but I uh, remembered to record this on this last one. So, you fill your sink with steaming hot water, a little bit of, a little bit of dish soap. But what you do is you pour about two cups worth of bleach into the water as well. You get it as hot as you can, a little bit of dish soap, and that bleach in there. And then what you do is you take your jar, just crack the lid, right? And you, we're gonna submerge it in the bleach water, the hot bleach water. Submerge it all the way down in there. You gotta compete with the other jars that are in there. And then you open it up under the water, like that. Woo, that smells. What this does is you let it set for 20 minutes and it's going to kill any bacteria or fungus or whatever you've got going on in that jar a 20 minute soak of hot bleach water is going to kill everything now it's going to be a little bit messy because when i pull the jars out uh there's going to be a considerable amount of grain in there because i've got like five jars in there right now so it's going to be like five quarts of nasty ass grain in there but the kicker is that it's all going to be dead so you don't got to worry about getting any of it on you, into the air, anything like that. So this is, I don't even know what to call it, uh, bleach water tech? <laughs> Maybe I'll come up with something better uh, than this. But uh, for the time being, at least I can get this out and show you guys how to do this and to uh, make sure that your workspace, your clothes, you all of that is safe from getting the contaminant in the air and on you. All right. Well, until next time, guys, stay safe out there and happy cultivating. Beard out. <laughs>